All new at 6, the Canadian government posing a slim chance its border with the U.S. will open in time for Canadians to make their annual migration to the desert. News Channel 3's Shelby Nelson has a closer look at how this could impact the valley. An agreement between the United States and Canada is up in less than a week. Now the Canadian Prime Minister is saying that COVID-19 cases in the U.S. may be too high to reopen the border. We keep extending the border closures because the United States is not in a place where uh, where we would be, feel comfortable reopening those borders. Canada Prime Minister Justin Trudeau foreshadowing what could come before next Wednesday. That a deadline runs out for an agreement to extend border limitations. We want them here and there are a lot of reasons for us to want them here. Coachella Valley Economic Partnership CEO Joe Wallace says snowbirds play a key role in our economy, especially as we move into the colder months. Not having snowbirds here has the same negative economic impact of losing the music festivals or losing the tennis tournament. Wallace says not having Canadians make their annual stopover in the Valley could mean about $450 million lost. Businesses throughout the desert rely heavily on the annual migration. Two family-owned La Quinta restaurants are hoping things will pick up. The locals, thankfully, really give us a lot of support. However, of course, we rely, just like most businesses around here, on the snowbirds uh, because that can double your business. Uh, during the season. All of us in the valley here, we do rely on our snowbirds. Both restaurants are now back open following the state mandated months long closure. La Brasserie Bistro and bar co owner Kara Jana says the year has been nothing less than interesting. Even if the snowbirds were here at the full amount, we still have so many restrictions from the governor. Nancy Prieto, co-owner of new restaurant Tequila's Agave Bar and Grill, says they opened for seven days before shutting down in March. We're absolutely looking forward to when the season does hit to see how we do. The two restaurants grateful that locals are stepping up to help keep their doors open. The good news is that all Snowbirds are not Canadians. And what the Prime Minister of Canada says has absolutely no bearing on people from Washington State, from Oregon. In La Quinta, Shelby Nelson, News Channel 3.